Hey everybody, today I'm going to be crushing a large neodymium magnet. If you haven't used these things before, they're awesome. They're really strong magnets. Um, to spice things up even more, I'm going to be adding some ferrofluid to the mix. If you've never seen ferrofluid before, it's awesome. Let me show you some things that it can do. So ferrofluid is made of nanoparticles of iron or some other ferromagnetic material. And what it does is pretty cool when you apply a magnetic field to it. Okay, so when you apply a strong magnetic field to it, look what happens. Wow, it's like a porcupine. So this is called normal field instability. It's the shape the fluid takes to minimize the energy. Very unstable. Blow on it. Okay, so what I did here is I filled up a bottle with isopropyl alcohol, rubbing alcohol, at least 70%. Um, then I put some ferrofluid in it. And this is how you can really see the effect. Pretty cool. Watch this. It looks like it's alive. Okay, so I'm not quite sure what will happen, but what I'm expecting is that when the magnet comes down, it's gonna pick up the ferrofluid like that, gather around it, and then it'll keep coming down and it'll crush the magnet. So let's see what happens. Let's do it. Oh, it's taking the whole plate with it. There it comes. <laughs> wow, that didn't even crack. Okay, this is really cool. This is the magnet that has the ferrofluid on it. There's it creates a nice coating to it, very little friction. It can spin forever like that. Since our other magnet got ferrofluid all over it, we'll try this guy. That is what it just did to my steel plate. It's made a huge divot in it. So I couldn't crush that square one, I couldn't crush the small round one. I'm gonna say neodymium magnets have won this battle. But I do have a ceramic magnet. This is also the strongest type of ceramic magnet, but I think the press can crush it. Let's see. You came to see a magnet get crushed, you're gonna see it crush.
The magnet snowman. Dust magnet snowman. We crushed the ferrofluid, if you call that crushing. The neodymium magnets uh, would not crush. Pretty strong, stronger than I thought. And then we crushed a ceramic magnet.